And in Arapahoe County, a daycare worker now facing the consequences after a pair of two-year-olds were able to wander away from that facility. Our investigator Rick Salinger has been following the case at Rising Stars Daycare. It's near South Peoria and Cornell. Rick, a worker was sentenced today. Jim, we first reported on this case back in May when it happened. Parents were scared when a couple of toddlers got away from the daycare and were wandering down the street. Today, the person responsible for them was sentenced in court. Bishara Mohammed left court after being sentenced to a year of probation after her earlier plea of guilty to negligent child abuse, a misdemeanor. Can I speak to you through your interpreter? No. It was last May when two toddlers, each two years old, walked away from the daycare. This woman's husband spotted their child. He's seen two cars pull up, so he pulled up behind the cars, and it was a witness who had also seen them. And then, you know, three to five minutes pass, and the daycare finally arrives to his car, which is at the U.S. Bank. Mohammed told authorities she brought the kids outside with her as she took out the trash. A bank employee then spotted the children. She couldn't believe it. You know, two little kids running. She said they initially almost got hit by a car because they were running right down the middle of Cornell. Um, they managed to make it back on the sidewalk, and they were still running. State records we obtained show the Department of Human Services conducted an investigation. Probation was recommended for the daycare, but the case is ongoing. It's hard enough leaving your kids with complete strangers. Um, you think that they're well taken care of, they're, everything's okay, and then this happened. Mohammed's attorney told the court his client was sorry and admitted making a mistake. Despite the probation, Ms. Mohammed was sentenced to community service and also a fine. The daycare has not returned our call today for a response. Jim and Karen, this could have been a lot worse. Live in Aurora, Rick Salinger, covering Colorado First. Sure could have, Rick. Thank you.